What's going on guys? Thank you so much for coming back today. Today I have a very special video planned for you guys. I have an A-OK -okay from a dear friend of mine, David, over at Pop Fiction. I'm gonna get into that box. And then I have a Toy USA, the Scavenger Hunt, $60 guaranteed damage mystery box. We'll get into the top hits of that later. First, let's get into the box that David sent over. Um, now I did go ahead and open it uh, just to make sure. But then I saw this because... That rascal told me he was only going to send me one pop, and then I get this box in, and he said, don't get excited, laugh out loud, uh, just repurposing the box, enjoy. So I said, you know what, I probably need to wait and do this on a video. So, um, I'm waiting, I'm opening it up right now, because it definitely does not feel like just one pop inside this box. What are you doing, man? We agreed on just one pop. Uh, but I do know what he sent over. Um, now this will go into my wife's set. Um, she collects a Disney. Oh, wow. Okay, so he sent in these little figures. It's like a... Oh, one of those car garbage pail kids. I don't know if it'll pick that up on the camera or not. I'm not quite sure what that one is. Maybe he can tell me on that one. And then... Yeah... <laughs> Oh, man, that's a pretty cool one, too. That one as well. All right, so he has this. It says, read after. Oops, some stuff fell out of it. Oh, man, we have some stickers. So we have a Mickey Mouse sticker. And then, oh, sweet. So we got this sticker as well. But then he did send over a pack of Garbage Pail Kids. That's awesome. All right, we'll get into that. Man, this box is full of stuff, man. What are you doing? All right, so, man, I love this one. So, um, many of you that watch the channel know that my wife collects Disney. So he, I guess he'd pull this out of a mystery box or however he found it. Uh, but it is the Halloween Donald. It is the 2017 Fall Convention um, exclusive, which is really freaking cool. It's from Kingdom Hearts. Is the Halloween Donald. It's going to look great on her set. Dude, that's so awesome. So awesome you send this over. And then he sent over a Star Wars. This is Star Wars. And there's more stuff inside the box. What are you doing, man? Oh, that's, that's so funny. As many of you would call it, Baby Yoda. Uh, it's more Mickey. Let's see here. This is definitely a Garbage Pail Kid. Pretty cool. And then, I don't know what these are. MTV Yo Raps. That's pretty cool. We'll get into that, and we'll get into the Garbage Pro Kids. And he sent over this one. Um, I don't quite know how to pronounce this one. Quar? Maybe? I don't know. Maybe? If I'm wrong, correct me down in the comments. Please don't roast me, though. Um, but this is from this is from the Han Solo movie. Yeah, I've never seen this one before. But, you know, I could have used this one when I did the alphabet challenge with Q's because I had such a hard time getting those. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, let's open the Yo Raps. What, MC Hammer? What? <laughs> oh, these are... Okay, okay. You have MC Hammer. Still got my MC Hammer doll, LL Cool J. Dude, I've never heard of these cards, but they're freaking awesome. Heavy D and the Boys. Uh, Public Enemy. Public Enemy. Um, Eric B. and Rakeem. I don't know if I've ever heard of them. Uh, young MC. And then Young MC is the next one as well. <laughs> I've never heard of these cards. It's pretty freaking awesome. Dr. Dre and Ed Lover. And then we have three times dope. In case you're wondering what that looks like. I mean, that right there is three times dope right there. Uh, Run DMC. Uh, Run DMC as well. Then we have Biz Markie. Pretty cool. <laughs> Um, 
Houdini? Don't know this one as well. Uh, Big Daddy Kane with the most serious look you could ever have. Big Daddy Kane. And then... We have this one. That's a repeat. Eric B. Here's more Eric B. And then we have Fab Five Freddy. That was hard to say. Alright, but the last one is the Fab Five Freddy. Man, that's really tough to say. Alright. <laughs> so these are definitely pretty cool. Never seen them before. Alright. I'm so excited for these. We have Odd Todd. Chicago Ed. And then the last one we have Maud Mueller. Dude, that's so awesome, man. Alright, let's get into the note. Let's see what all he said. Alright, read after. Okay. Dear Brandon, let me start off by saying please forgive me for taking so long to get this package into the mail. You know, it was, it was, you did this out of the kindness of your heart, man. You never have to apologize for if it took too long at all. Okay, I had no clue I was going to get so busy and it would take me this long. I do apologize. Life is crazy for everyone right now. Uh, so I totally understand. So you should already know that the contents of the box, of course, the main reason I sent it uh, was the Halloween Donald Duck, which I hope you and your wife enjoy. Um, it was pulled from a Smile World mystery box a while back and just doesn't fit in my collection. Knowing your wife is a Disney fan, I figured you would be, um, it would be a perfect home. Um, I decided I want to send you a little something. I don't know if you will have it or not, but I figured since the first time I sent you something, it was Disney and Star Wars Pop, I will continue that theme with this box. You're welcome to pass that along if you, uh, it's not, you're welcome to pass it along if it's not something that you like. Um, maybe you sent it as a gift. It's not going anywhere. Promise you. Um, these cards and odds and ends are just for nostalgia fun. They really are, man. I've never seen the MTV cards. Those are freaking awesome. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoy. I have enjoyed getting to know you a little bit and watching your channel, which is super awesome. Keep up the great work. Have a Funko-tastic day. Your friend, David, a.k.a. AKA Pop Fiction. Um, yeah. How me and David met is we were doing the Funko Pay It Forward, and he had gotten me, and he wanted to, like, send me messages to get to know me, see what kind of stuff I was into and stuff like that. We got to talking and really built up a strong friendship. Me and him talk. Um, you know, like I said, like he said, life is crazy, life is busy, um, but we find time to talk and stuff like that. Super nice guy. I have his channel linked down below along with his Instagram, so you guys can go check him out. Show him some love. Has a great channel. Um, great, great dude. David, I cannot thank you enough just for sending this. Thank you so much, man. All right. All right. Let's get into Toy USA. We have it right here. Should be four pops inside here. Um, contents of the box. There was 100 boxes total. Guaranteed $60 in value in every box. Now, these boxes are damaged, so there will be damage inside here. Um, of course, I'm going to throw a picture so that you guys can see it, but the top hit inside here is the OG, oh man, such a grail, Ace Ventura. It, that is one that I want so bad. I've wanted it ever since I started collecting Funko Pops. The Ace Ventura, I want the Allen with Baby Carlos, which Miles, I'm going to steal it from him one day. Uh, but there's so many great Pops inside here. A lot of Walking Dead, E.T., uh, let's see, we have some, some older Disney inside here. Um, let's see, what we have the Alexa Bliss. Let's see what else we got in here. Some Nightmare Before Christmas. And I would love to pull out the OG, like the Robin Hood too. That would be a sweet one to pull out. But, great hits inside here. 100 boxes total. Four pops inside the box. Will contain damage, but it is a guaranteed $60 back. So... Um, we cannot account for any damage, so whatever PPG says on these pops, that's what, that's what they are. So, um, let's go ahead and bust this bad boy open and see what we get. I'm gonna open it from the bottom. And go ahead and pull up PPG. Okay, got PPG pulled up. Let's go ahead and bust this guy open and see what we get. 
I think my knife's getting a little dull. Alright, so I do feel four pops inside here. Try not to look. I feel one in a protector. So we do have one in protector. So, and, and as you can see, they are upside down, so I can't see what it is. Um, let's start with, uh, start with this one right here. Let's see what we pull out in this first one here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ugh. Oh! Wow, this is a good one. I remember seeing this sitting on the shelves for a very long time, and I never picked it up. But this is from Independence Day. This is Alien, the FYE exclusive. Um, now, we used to have, have a... Around here, they're called Sam Goodies. Uh, but they would still hold, like, FYE stuff. And we used to have one in my hometown, but it shut down a couple years ago, uh, right before COVID. Um, missed that thing... Miss that place every day because I would just love to go and just look, see what they have. A um, little bit of box damage right here. This is a 2016 pop. This might hold some value. I don't know. Let's look it up. Okay. So right now on the pop price guide, this guy coming in a value of seven bucks. I don't even care because I like this one. So that's the score right there. Keeping that one. All right. So let's move on to pop number two out of the box. Not Air Protector. Oh, okay. So we have Frozen 2. I believe that's... I'm not a big Frozen 2 fan. That shock scene one. Is it Sven? Sven, maybe? Uh, I'm probably going to get roasted by like every six-year-old girl in America right now. Looks like a newer pop. Obviously, Frozen 2 is a newer. So let's go and see what we pulled out on that one. Okay, so also on this one too, the box is pretty mint. There's nothing wrong with this box, but this one is coming in a value of seven bucks. Uh, so so far we're only at fourteen dollar value um, out of the sixty dollar box. Now this one is the protector. All right, so last one, pop number three without a protector. We have, oh man, yes, I love this one, and we do not have this one. And I'm sure my wife will try to strike up a deal with this, but uh-uh-uh. We're going to make a trade for this one. Uh, but this is the Alien Hot Top Exclusive Diamond Edition. That is a freaking cool one. We did miss out on this one. Um, but I'm excited to see, again, box damage. None. This box is good. I believe this pop just came out last year. I think 2020. Alright, so let's go ahead and check and see what that one is worth before we get into the one in a protector. So this is something kind of weird. I don't know if uh, Pop Price Guys is a little messed up, but the Hot Topic sticker is coming in a value of $16, where the Special Edition sticker is coming in a value of $22. It's kind of weird. Um, but we got $16, $14, what is that, $30? So this next pop has to be at least 30 bucks. Okay, so the last one out of the box. In a protector. Oh, come on. Give me something good. In three, two, one. I know this one is on my wife's wish list for a very, very long time. Man, this is like her box, man. Like, I didn't even get anything cool out of it. Because I know she's going to take the Halloween Donald, of course. She's going to take the Diamond Edition Alien, of course. Uh, she'll probably take the Frozen 2, of course. I'll probably get stuck with the $7 Alien. That's the way it rolls, man. Alright, so. Pop number 4 out of the box. Dapper Sally. Hot Topic Exclusive. Diamond Edition. Oh, man. Still in. Still has the wrap on it. Let's go ahead and pull it out. See what kind of conditions she's in. Oh, man. She's mint. Alright, so as I did look her up, uh, she's coming in a value right now of $32. So we spent $60, don't count the shipping, but we got back $62 on a damaged mystery box from Toy USA. And honestly, none of the pops had any damage on them. So, um, nothing else in the box. But... I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy ordering um, Toy USA boxes. 
Uh, I've actually gotten a top hit from them before. I love the pops that we do get. Um, it's something that you don't normally see pulled a lot. Um, always very happy with Toy USA. Um, but that is the that is the video today. Uh, thank you so much, David. Thank you so much. Go check him out, guys. Pop Fiction. Go check him out. If you don't, you'll regret it. Um, but as it goes for Toy USA, drop me a comment down in below. Which one was your favorite today? Uh, let's see here. We have the Dapper Sally. Alien Remix Alien. The, uh, not Alien Remix. Uh, the Toy Story Alien. Um, and then we have the Halloween Donald. Which, I gotta say, that is one of the coolest ones. But I'm definitely gonna go with the Diamond Edition Alien from Toy Story. But that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much. Uh, for checking out today's video. Um, if it is your first time here, I definitely appreciate you hitting the like button. If you're not a subscriber, become one. It's absolutely free. Down there in the corner, just hit If it's red, turn it to gray. And then out beside that, hit that little bell notification and select all so that way YouTube notifies you anytime that I upload a new video. But that's all I have for you today, guys. I love you guys. I love you, Mom. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks, guys.